Oh, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good, guys. Look at just look at the water. Don't you just want to like jump in it? I mean, it might be like a little cold, but like if we had like some kind of like thermal swimmy suit on, that'd be good. Oh, so Rob, it's gonna be only a few minutes from the office. Uh, nice, nice. Oh, it has a patio. Okay, all right. Ground floor. There you go. There you go. That'll be great, man. I'm so excited for you. Don't make me cry now. Don't you make me cry, you silly bean. <laughs> Dave, I'm glad that you're doing well. Just been playing some... Oh gosh, remind me. What is what is this? What is this? I'm doing well. I'm doing well. Thank you, Brian. How you doing, friend? It's good to see you. The little penguin creatures that have, like, just... Uh, yeah, I think it's some kind of penguin variation. Look at the little babies. I love them. I love them. <sighs> Serenity, hello! Serenity, are you excited as I am? Serenity is a big uh, Subnautica fan as well. I know she's gonna be doing some below zero too. Oh, please make sure to go send Serenity some love. Can we get an exclamation Serenity in chat if we haven't already? Kingdom come deliverance. Thank you, thank you. I, yeah, <laughs> I always remember the kingdom part, but nothing after that. Thank you for the Serenity, I appreciate it. All right, guys, we ready to do the thing? Hopefully, music will be okay. All right. <sighs> um, I don't want to go go stream for a week. No, I like. I know so many of you guys have been like as excited as I am too. So like, I I don't want to spoil it for anybody that has wanted to experience it on their own terms. So you know, know that like. If that is something that you are wanting to do, I completely understand, but I'm also like really excited to have you here. Let's do it. Start a new game. We're gonna just do the, the basic survival stuff. No hardcore. <gasps> look, look at the little dude. Look at him on like the loading bar. I love that. Oh, it's the small things. So when you're like loading into the original Subnautica, it has, um, I think it has the Aurora in orbit and and now it's like this ship so like is this one like crashing to um planet 4546b as well press press any button to continue okay all right this is the farthest that i can take you on company space box robin you sure you want this the research i want this i want it this me and sam I need to know what happened. The meteor storm. I can use it for cover from Altera's eyes. <sighs> Let's get gonna miss you, Robin. I'll find my way back. Whoa! Okay, all right. So we're going to the planet. Oh, 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 oh! This was not a good time to 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 just go there. Okay, all right. New, a little loud. Yeah, I know. I'll have to do it after this cutscene if that's okay. <laughs> Oh, oh, okay, all right, this isn't good. Oh, ow. Okay, all right, may have a few bruises in the morning. Nailed the landing. Okay, all right. Well, why is it that when we always land on this planet, there's fire and, um, like, near death? Open the door! Wouldn't, wouldn't it be interesting if you died, like, right there? End of game. <laughs> well, it was it was fun knowing you guys. Uh, oh, hello! <laughs> huh? There's like a... There was a thing that landed over there. Oh, okay, alright. Let me uh, turn down the music a little bit. Oh, wow. Um... Interesting. Okay. Um, let me do, um, maybe I'll do like this. Try like that. How's that, guys? How's that doing? I feel like, I kind of want to like look around here. Oh yeah, nutrient blocks. Okay, good stuff. Um, flare, if, oh, oh, I don't really want to use the flare right now. If the flares are anything like, uh, they were in, um, in the original Subnautica, I probably will never use them. TBH. Um, but we'll take it. We'll take it regardless. 
I hope that like this is not like this is like not like a time thing because I'm just you know I'm just enjoying going around here right now and picking up things that I might need open PDA here we go all right so it looks pretty similar to our, our original PDA um, we already have some survival based stuff maybe I should you know wait to read those until we're in like slightly safer territory oh I'm freezing I'm freezing it's like the the frost is coming around my vision this is not good um okay maybe I should run should I go that way should I go that way I don't know <laughs> oh hello oh Oops. that did not go as planned I should find a way into the water and get to the drop pod. These are warming me up. Okay, all right, cool beans. Has the destruction ended? How convenient that it ends right as we turn the corner. <laughs> totally not planned. I don't know if I should go this way or that way. I just feel conflicted. Um, Cause it doesn't seem like they can join. Oh, I just, I feel like I'm missing something and it's just like really bothering me. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Lily. How are you? I hope you're having a great day. Apologies in advance, guys. If I like miss any messages today, feel free to like repost if I miss anything. Because I just, I, I don't want to miss anything. Because um, I, I love your faces. Oh, maybe it did conjoin. Right, yeah, right there. I just, I, yeah, I kind of just looped myself, went in a circle arena, but here we are. Here we are. So much is happening, right? Right? So yeah, no, I, I turned it down. Um, if it's like too quiet now, let me know. Let me know. Um, I can bring it back to like the, the 15 for like overall volume and like individually lower the other ones. Okay. All right. There's like a big like cliff thing out there. You guys see that? And our the the thing that fell from the sky is right there. I think I see the penguins. There's something bobbing right there, and that makes me a little nervous. Don't know what that thing is that's moving. All right, okay. Oh, oh, I should probably get like some more heat before we go anywhere. Um, because I'm just I'm taking in the view. I'm freezing my buns off. Hypothermia. That's not good, fam. You know, it was like. <sighs> We, you did have like, you know, a, a temperature like gauge type thing in Subnautica in the original one. Like when you went to like Lava Zone and that type deal. Um, but like it wasn't something that you had to constantly be aware of. Whereas like this one, it's, it's seeming like that's the case. Okay, okay, it's just little fishies there. Do I have a, no, I don't have a, I don't have a scanner. Oh, that's probably something that I have to, like, actually, like, make, right? I feel like I shouldn't go in the icy water, but I feel like at some point, like, right now, we're gonna have to. We're in. We're in, friends. It is sounding, like, a little quiet to me, so what I might do is this, and then... Um voice volume maybe that can go down to like this we'll see how that is perhaps perhaps he's it's hard to tell right now since it's so quiet hi hi little guy i'm assuming that they're friendly they they look pretty nice but that doesn't necessarily mean we have found our first limestone. It's like a different color in this game, um, but like basically same model. I did hear that they like reused some assets. Oh my gosh, are those peepers? Is that a peeper that I see? Oh, peepers are good eating. All right, okay, all right. I don't have a tank or anything right now, do I? I want to take that peeper. Oh, there's several, there's several peepers. We're good, we're good. Is this one? Oh, 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 he was so fast, he was so fast. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, we gotta get some some fins or something. Oh, oh, uh, explosions? Oh, rain! There's weather in here? I'm assuming that this is like, that this is random, that it happens. Look at it falling underneath the water! Oh, guys, I'm just, I'm so pleased. I'm so pleased. Oh, it's the small things. Um, 
I'm assuming it's not like a scripted thing. That's so cool. Especially considering in original Subnautica, it was like, it was just sunny all the time. You know, except at, at night, then not as sunny. Yes. Hi, Sarah, how are you? I hope you're having a good one. <sighs> okay, uh, enter base. Found the drop pod. Is this, is this like this earth starter little base here? Data bank entry unlocked. Logs and communications. I like that. It, it seems like characters, you actually get to see like their pictures in this game. That's cool. That's cool indeed. <sighs> Peepers are friends, not food. I mean, like, why not both? <laughs> Arctic Survival Almanac on arrival. Welcome to Adventure Mode, Xeno, Xeno Worker. No one's ever called me a Xeno Worker before. You have arrived in an Arctic climate. Your great expedition begins. I'm so excited. Your Xeno, Xeno Works PDA is equipped to monitor your temperature and vital signs. That's good. Uh, since you have downloaded the Arctic Survival Almanac, don't even remember doing that, I will also dispense advice from time to time. I guess that might be might be a little nice. <laughs> For the benefit of future adventures, your advice will also recur, rec record, what? record observations uh, and findings you make. Okay. Survival checklist. Retreat to a safe environment. Administer first aid if required. I think we're good. I think we're good on the... Um, the well, first, Sam, the I first guess aid. I might as well gather some tools and resources before starting my search. I hope that radio tower is as easy to spot as Lil said. Uh, hang on, hold up. Um, yeah, because I think the red was our health. Um, the the uh, yellow is our food. Oh, we really need to eat something. Blue is hydration. Forty-five. What is the forty-five? There's like more dials than there were in the original. Retrieve emergency supplies. Survey the environment for threats and resources. I'm sure there's no threats out there, right? Right? Hopefully. <laughs> Sonia, where did that, where did that emote come from? Oh no, this is a really wet situation. Oh my. <laughs> Uh, look at our streamer being amazed. It's just like everything I hoped and more already and we're only like five minutes in. Ugh. Construct necessary survival equipment using the habitat fabricator. Locate other survivors using a line of sight on the radio. Maintain physical and psychological health until rescue. So there could be other people out there. Maybe, hopefully. Arctic survival almanac, the surface. Adventurers exploring the surface in cold weather climates are advised to take additional precautions. High winds can result in rapid onset of hypothermia. So we won't freeze to death in the water. That's really good considering it's a water exploration game. <laughs> and I don't want to have to be worrying about, you know, dying of frostbite 24-7. Keep an eye out for natural shelter or re rest rest restorative? Rest restorative. Restorative? one of those um hot springs there's hot springs in this game oh sign me up i love a good hot springs if wearing a standard issue aep suit uh bodies of water may provide safety from extreme cold unexpected uh, detours occur you never know how long you'll be away from home base remember to pack lunch a toasty hot beverage if possible can we make like some hot cocoa that'd be absolutely lovely we can't uh, say this enough layers investing in cool uh, quality cold suit is certain to pay dividends in warmth and safety remember when in doubt don't go out <laughs> that's already my motto that works out so we have a lot of stuff about from Sam or about Sam. I guess we'll start with this. I'm sorry about your sister. I guess we'll listen to this. Let me catch up on chat first, though. Been playing on the difficulty without food and water because I don't really care for, for those kind of things. That's fair. That's fair. And that's why I like the games like offer those options so that people can play how they want to. And I really like that. I really like that. All right, here we go. I want to offer my sincerest condolences on the passing of your sister. So this is Lillian. I got to know Sam better towards the end of my mandate with Alteron and... 456. 
And Sam was our sister, but she's dead? She spoke often and fondly of you. Well, I, I hope so. Know. She's my sister. It didn't sit right with me when Altera blamed Sam's death on negligence. The Samantha Ayu I met was many things. Kind, clever, devoted to her work, but never negligent. I wish I could offer you something more substantial, but my access to information has been cut off. You may be in a better position to look into things than I am. If you're able to, Delta Station was our HQ. They were in a big hurry to leave, and there might still be information to be found there. It has a big radio tower, impossible to miss. I hope you find the answers you seek. Lillian Bench. Bench is a pretty cool last name, not gonna lie. Um, so what I'm understanding from this is our sister and I suppose us too, maybe? Um, but at least our sister Sam worked for good old Altera. Um, and they just blamed her death on her. They're like, she was being stupid and now she did. Um, but Lillian, I don't really know who Lillian is yet, but she is like, Altera, like, they were BSing you. Um... Yeah, it wasn't her fault. Okay, interesting. Notice of death, bless. Further details are unavailable at this time. Receive a contract, please allow me to communicate, da 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 da. Concerning the responsibilities of next of kin, if you have any questions, interesting, interesting. Okay, all right, we have a lot of audio files to listen to. Hi, Black Lion, how's it going? And Thundy, hello, something smells fishy around here. It's me, it's me, how's it going? <laughs> I've been in the water. Thundy, are you gonna be playing this? And Phantom, hello, friend, how's it going? I hope that you're having a lovely day. Um, Dave, thank you for the exclamation, Phantom. Thank you for the exclamation, Thunder Scepter, or the exclamation, shout out, yeah, those are words. <laughs> Both very juicy beans. Going well, thanks, glad to hear it, glad to hear it. All right, here we go, let's see, Sam message one. So this is from our sister. Oh, wait, what? Robin, guess what? I got the job. I'm going to 4546B. Now I'll be able to improve the mechanical avian and amphibian Look at our sister there, she's condition. so precious. Listen, I know your stance Let me on thank you for the host. But I just hope you're happy, your sis is happy. I sure hope my sis is happy. I mean, I would have been happier if she again. didn't die. Oh, I wanted to ask you something. Can you watch my Augie while I'm away? Augie? I need someone I can trust to look after my best little potatoes. <laughs> I love her potatoes. already. Listen. And she's I'm already dead. <laughs> Big sad. He's my little extra bite. I'll leave the starchy tubers and nicknames to you. Anyway, if you say yes, thanks, baby sis. Love you. And if I say no, no, I, I'm just kidding. I would always watch the potatoes. <laughs> we'll try to avoid eating him. <laughs> now we have to keep him. Did we bring, what was his name? <clears throat> Did we bring um augie with us on this endeavor is he like in our pocket right now probably for the best that he's not we might get hungry hey jack welcome in how's it going um right right hey howard how are you i hope you're having a good one i want to watch potato i mean what <laughs> oh so this is our sister and she's with like I was thinking that it looked like the, um, the, the penguin dudes, but now I'm thinking it's a machine. Four, five, four, six, B to Robin. Come in, Robin. <laughs> Remember when we used to play old-timey space explorer? This is kind of like that, but it's even harder to communicate. <laughs> well, let's see. I got your last message. Altera is not, as you put it, alterrorizing me. Things not well. yet. My project has a new name. Say goodbye to the mechanical avian amphibian and hello to spy penguins. Is that what he is? A spy penguin? Check out the photo. And I think I'm kind of seeing someone. Ooh, get a like girl. Me. Just find a date, let alone on a mostly uninhabited water planet. Find somebody to warm you up in those Actually, you know freezing what? temperatures. I forget I said anything. Yeah, it's, it's probably not even a real thing, but anyway, um. 
I'm sorry to hear Xenoworks might be strapped in the revenue department. Sounds like they still have you busy Xenoworking, though. I know there's no way to guarantee an alien intelligence startup will succeed, but you've put so much into it. I hope they find a way to keep going. I know how much it means to you, getting to work in a small place where you have control over your research. All right, I gotta go. Later, baby sis. Love you. Okay, so she brought up the Xenoworks uh, title, name, word, whatever you want to call it from earlier. So I was just, I know that our sister worked for Altera like you you did in the original game. I kind of just assumed that we worked for Altera too, but no, we work for this other company called Xenoworks. Okay, interesting. I think Xenoworks stole the uh, the 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 um, design for the the tablet from Altera or maybe vice versa. Maybe Altera stole it from them. They look very similar, very similar. <laughs> Let's see about number 3. Mm, the landing was uh was was a little rough, just a little bit, just a little bit. Wouldn't want Augie to get uh get hurt in the landing there. He might become a, a bit of a crispy potato. <laughs> hey Robin, I got your Augie photo. Thanks so much for taking care of him. So we Even were taking care of Augie. Potato. Hey, the nickname actually fits that way. A cranky potato. I know he can be a ham. I'm a cranky guy. potato. I really <laughs> I'm Aren't we all cranky potatoes at some point? <laughs> One of my penguins found something. Something big. Well, Altera is just like nothing to see here. I was wondering what that noise was. It's my I'm glad you can't answer. It's my food! Can't. I need to eat. Rub it in my face. Alright, after this we gotta go back grab like some back. peepers. A little bit right about that. Where's Augie when we need him? My job. My safety. Um, I heard about Xenoworks getting bought. I'm sorry. But at least you still have your job. Wait, so is Xenoworks being now. bought by like Altera? Welcome yeah. to the Altera family. <laughs> Big I sad. Go before I say something. There's no escaping Love Altera? You. All Get roads lead back to Altera? Alien prize. Well, alright. We've got to listen to the other two, but I am currently, like, um, about to like hunger to death. <laughs> yes. I love that there's this little window there. That's kind of precious. Okay. Uh, eat something. Yes. I mean, I do have the nutrient blocks. I'd kind of rather save them though. If I can grab me a peeper. Um, at this point, I'd probably grab like any. Ooh, and we can take. <gasps> are these bladder fish? They are bladder fish. Okay. All right. So we have bladder fish too. Um, bladder fish are going to be good for. New blueprint synthesized. For filtered water. We also have an air bladder. I'll probably never make that, to be honest. Um, it's a new voice in this game. It's not the same one. Oxygen. Okay. All right. It's like kind of like ominous, like how you swim up, and it's just like just white. <laughs> That's like a little scary. It's like, am I swimming into heaven? Um, hello. I know that there were some peepers around here. Where'd you go? I mean, like, I guess I could take the hoop fish. The hoop fish just aren't like as like assuming it has like the same like nutritional value. Yeah, I don't think they're gonna be as good, but peepers are so speedy! Come here! Come hither! Ha, 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 ha. Arctic peeper! They do look a little different. Okay, let's get some more. Let's get some more. Just stay still. Just stay still, sir. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, oh, gosh darn it. Alright, let's, let's go for something else then. Um, whom else can I eat? I think this is a boomerang fish over here. Um, hmm. Wait a minute, was that? Ooh. What? J Jelena? G How do you say that, guys? Jelena? Galena. Should be able to use this. We got titanium out of it. So, in original Subnautica, like, your starter outcrops were limestone ones. And I know that there's limestone in this one because we already got some. But there's also that we just got the Jelena? Galena? I'm going to say Galena. Um, and that gave us titanium. 
kind of like the uh, uh, the original game would give us titanium or copper in um, in limestone. So I'm wondering what else we can get from uh, from the Galena, whatever. How's my health? Oh, we got two. We got two. I need to eat. Where's my pod? Where is it? Where's the face? Oxygen. Okay. All right. I'll get that too. This is not good. Guys, I can't. Oh, right here, right here. <laughs> hey, Trip Zero, how's it going, man? Nice to see you. Guys, thanks for doing this shout out for Trip. I appreciate it. Trip um, was playing some. Um, oh, this is storage. This is storage. Uh, Trip was playing some Resident Evil 8 the other day on his stream. Um, also, some of the W game. Please make sure to go send him some love. All right, paper, paper time. Quickly, quickly. Okay, all right. Seek fluid intake. Oh, I'm just, I need to obtain all the, 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 the substances. Okay, <laughs> all right, let's do this. That was, that was a little close. How's the release date treating you? So good so far. I've just been so excited for this game and I'm so glad to have you guys here with me. And James, nice to see you. All the juicy beans coming in. Hi guys, how's it going? Anybody in here planning on playing some uh, Below Zero yourselves? I don't want to spoil it for anybody, but I'm just, I'm so excited to have you guys here for, for my first experience with it. Wait a minute. Okay. So I was wondering what this green bar was beside uh, the fish. I think in this game, it tells you how close it is to spoiling. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Okay. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and drink some water as well. Yeah, we'll do both of those. I'm gonna go ahead and put these uh, these flares away. All right, um, we'll go ahead and put the nutrient blocks in there too, sure, at least a couple of them. All right, I'd like to get a little more food since we're only halfway. Um, and then we'll, we'll go back to, I guess we could listen to the stuff while we're swimming around. How does that sound? I think it'll, I think it'll allow us to do that. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Sam message numero cuatro. Um, this looks properly terrifying, isn't it wonderful? <laughs> the W game, the forbidden W game that we don't talk about. <laughs> Want to know something? As long as it's not spoilery. Sure, sure. Gonna watch you play first and then decide. Sounds good, sounds good. Did that work? No, it didn't. Hang on, let's try that again. Uh. Hey, Rob. I'm sorry. Bless her heart. Not sure what's going oh, on look at that big creature over there. I can't really talk about it either. Oh, and I'm definitely not dating anyone on this water planet. Don't know what I was thinking. Oh, there. it didn't work I out. Didn't Sorry, is. Sam. Get this. I can't even get my wash and go dry before the wind freezes the moisturizer in my hair. Wild, right? All right. I think that'll be good. Anyway, I think that'll be enough. I'm sure you're mad at me after what I said. I know, Sam. We I'm love sorry. you too. Don't be sorry. It's okay. I hope we didn't end things on a bad note. There's like another like voice log after this, so I'm assuming that we made up. Hopefully. Hopefully. Uh, do you plan on playing all of Subnautica one day? A lot on my plate? 100% understandable. Uh, don't hold back spoilers. I got you. I got you. I'm so glad to have you guys here. Mm. I worked on some uh, some designs of this game. Erica, what kind of uh, what kind of designs are we talking here? Mm. Um. Oh, Erica, were you like one of the, like the uh, like the play testers? That's pretty heckin' snazzy, if I do say so myself. All right, let's uh let's do number five, and then I was about to say we'll be caught up. We have like the personal log after that. Hey, Robin. I really need someone to know. I'm afraid something terrible is going to happen. It you did. It did. Right about Altera, okay? You were right. I was wrong. The cat should be called Potato. I admit it. <laughs> mm, sorry. Bad attempt at a joke. I just... I don't know what to do. 
I guess I should just come out and say it at this point. I've said this much already. We found a frozen Leviathan that's infected with Kara. I hope it stays frozen. Use it for something. Weapons, experimental treatments, a whole range of things. But one end of the range is ugly, dangerous, but, but profitable, of course. What if it gets out while we're messing around with it? Or worse? Did y'all never learn anything from the first game? I, I hope I'm overreacting, but I don't think I am. Anyway, uh, message me back, please. I could really use a friend. You're my sister. Did we never reach out to her before she died? That's terrible. Um, okay. So she like knew that like something bad was gonna happen like did she know too much did Altera kill her did she get killed i don't think it said how she got killed they said it was negligence but i mean that doesn't really tell you anything um wait a minute wait is somebody somebody having a birth hang on who's having a birthday Hold up. Tell me juicy details. Please, please. Oh, is it Lauren's birthday, Sarah? Please wish Lauren a happy birthday for us. I hope that you guys have some wonderful time together. That'll be juicy. Do you have any plans? Okay, so I'm going to see if I can grab, like, one more, maybe two more bladderfish. Um, and, oh, I guess we can go ahead and see if there's an audio lag here. Minerals galore. We'll listen to that while we're grabbing um, bladderfish. Nervous about dropping into an unknown area. That's but understandable. Luckily, this biome seems so we are Robin. I can use for tools and upgrades. I didn't want another situation like Byzantos five. When Zeno works, what happened there? Barely any resources. I survived off the land for three months with just a knife, my lucky PDA, and some rope. I am still kind of proud of that, though. Okay. All right. Um. Hmm. Any more of the things? Like, that's like a big guy over here. And he's like, like kind of like pretty colored, but like, he, he looks a little scary. He looks a little scary, especially considering I can swim like only like really slow right now. Maybe we'll try to like kind of stay away from him. Is it getting darker? Are we getting like to nighttime? I'm trying to figure out things. Um, okay. Oxygen. I was trying to see if there were any other bladderfish, but we might be kind of like overtaking the bladderfish boys from this area. So let's just um let's just do this one for now. And we'll see what else we can craft. As uh nice to see you below zero. That must be because Wade Lady is so cool. Oh shucks, oh shucks. I'll uh send the, the twenty dollars for that uh that kind statement later, Daza. <laughs> All right, water time. Here we go. It was good to see you in a uh, in live stream earlier. I hope that you're having the most marvelous of days. What's been going on? Ooh, to the Renaissance Fair. I've always wanted to go to one of those, Sarah. Getting her on my phone plan. So new phone and dinner sounds like a good day to me if I do say so myself. Nice, nice, nice. I'm gonna watch some uh, TV with Mama, but she uh, has stuff she wants to watch later. So I'll be back. Sounds good. Sounds good, Dave. Thanks for being here. Hope that you guys have some very pleasurable times together. Daza gets uh, paid for his kind statements? Where do I get that gig? <laughs> Rob, did you get my time at Porsche? Guys, my time at Porsche is on sale right now on Steam. If you have never played my time at Porsche, please do the thing. It's so wonderful. Oh, it is getting darker. Okay. All right. What else can we make? resources um right now we can make fiber mesh silicone rubber so the creep vine in this game is red instead of yellow we can make glass knowing me and my base building and it being more windows than actual base i'll probably be using a lot of that copper wire batteries okay so in the original game batteries were made of uh copper and was it titanium was that the other thing in here it's copper and ribbon plants that's new okay um and then you have your wiring kits too all right okay 
what do we have here? What can I make for myself? I really need a standard O2 tank. Um, so yeah, we need to make some fiber mesh. That's gonna be from the creep vine clusters, yeah? Oh no, just from the creep vine samples. Okay, so we need two of those for that. All right. Was it just uh, was it just one fiber mesh that I needed? Or was it two? Hang on. It was just one. Okay, so two um, creep vine samples. We're gonna wanna make some rubber. So for that, we'll need um, one creep vine seed cluster. Okay. First aid kits and compass. Oh, a compass would be lovely to have. Okay, so we're gonna need some silver and some more copper. Oh, scanner would be wonderful. <laughs> I need to make so many things. <laughs> we need to be on the lookout for some outcrops. Uh, Alice, thanks for the follow. How are you? I hope you're having a great day. Um, oh man, okay, all right. Survival knife. Um, we're gonna wanna make that too so we can defend ourselves. So maybe I'll get a couple um, creep vine samp or clusters. We've got so many things we need to do. We need to be on the lookout for outcrops though. And I hate going out here when it's dark, but alas, here we are. Wait a minute. It's a sea glide fragment right here. How did I not see that earlier? Um, okay, so once we actually have a scanner, we can do that. But what we need right now, guys, is to grab some creep vine stuffs. Um, and it's looking like there's some over here. What is that big dude over there? Oh, there's several of them. Oh, there's several. Um, okay. So in original Subnautica, in original Subnautica, when you're in the creep vine areas, you have to watch out for, what is it? The, um, oh, what are they? The, the stalkers. So far, I'm not seeing any stalkers, but that doesn't necessarily mean anything. All right, okay, all right. I'm gonna take you, you, but I can't get the samples yet because I don't have a knife. Okay, um, so yeah, we're gonna have to wait on that, but we do have this, the samples. We just needed two of those so that we can make some rubber. Right now I'm looking around to see if we can get some more outcrops. Ooh, was that lead? I think that was the first lead that I've gotten. Cool beans, cool beans. All the glowing things. I just love the bioluminescence. Look at this. This is like, how can something be so beautiful and so terrifying all at the same time? Like, just Sumatra does that so well. <laughs> Ooh, guys, when the moon hits your eyes like a big pizza pie. I don't think they have any pizza here. That's a big sad. Um, okay. All right. Um, maybe I'll go and take that bladder fish. Oh, oh, um, oh, he's swimming so fast. There we go. All right, cool beans. Not as fast as the peepers, though. That's good. That's good. Um, petite chameleon. I like the name. Thanks for the follow. How's it going? I hope you're having a great day. All right, I was looking around to see if we could find some more outcrops. <gasps> Is this the Aurora Borealis? It is. It's beautiful. Is it snowing too? Oh, I'm, I'm so glad that we have weather in this game. It's the small things, guys. It's the small things. Are these something? Bullseye shroom. All right. That'll be something that we can, like, take or, uh, plants. Something like that. Just looking around to see if we can get some, some more outcrops at the moment, because we needed a, a good amount of materials. Altera supply cache nearby. A Altera supply cache nearby? Is that on my, on my, on my thing? It looks like it's raining lava right now. This looks really ominous. I'm just gonna go back under the water. <laughs> Um, it's over there. All right, well, I really don't feel too comfortable about going over there until we have like, you know, some some swimmy boys or a tank or something like that. So yeah, let's continue to look around and see 
what we can obtain. Get a lot of titanium. You know it's Subnautica when you're getting a bunch of titanium. Copper, okay. Let me go and see what I have right now, what we can do with what we have, and uh, we'll go from there. Oxygen. Okay, all right. It'll be so nice when we have that tank. <laughs> now we want pizza. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, y'all. I think we've talked about this before, but what is your favorite type of pizza? Question to all of you. I, I love pizza. If it has like sun-dried tomatoes on it, that's really good. Or roasted garlic. Oh, oh, glorious. Okay, so... Let's start out by making the... I don't think I needed lube for anything right now, so I'm gonna make the this. Because I think we needed like three of those. I do think we needed copper wire for something, but before I waste my copper, let me let me take a look around. We can go ahead and make the fins. Oh, we'll be able to swim faster. Oh, glorious day. Okay, they automatically put themselves on. Cool beans. What else? Uh, we need the fiber mesh, but for that we need a knife. Copper wire is used for the compass, but we also need silver to making the wiring kit. I don't think I've come across any silver yet. <gasps> we can go ahead and make the survival knife. Cool beans. Okay, sweet. Let me go in here and also make some more water for ourselves. Mm, always good to have some lube. You guys are just uh, just some some dirty mother hackers, but I love y'all. I love y'all. <laughs> it's Friday, guys. It's not Thirsty Thursday anymore. You can't be like this. <laughs> we'll go ahead and drink some more water here. Might have to get some more food soon. Um, so now that we have our knife, which I'm going to put in this slot for now, we can go back over to the Creepvine clusters and we need, was it two? Was it two samples? I think it was two samples. Ooh, hello knife. How's it going? Cool beans. Now we can hex some, hex some creatures up. Best day ever. Ooh, ooh, speaking of best day ever, look at all these outcrops here. We can like break them like so much faster with our knife too. There's some quartz. Oh, okay, cool beans. Lots of titanium, which is not my top priority right now, Oxygen. game. I do kind of wish that like when you were swimming up like that, it wasn't just like straight, like, you know, just, I just saw like the shadow of like a big, creature over there and I was just like how close to them am I um I do wish that it it didn't look like quite like that because yeah it's like it's really hard to tell like how close to the surface you are um but yeah some more quartz okay cool beans um anything else of value down here <gasps> that drops down lower I I feel like I shouldn't go there though right now until we have that tank we're already chill. <laughs> we'll, we'll be full soon, guys. Oh no, we, we can't fit all the beans that need to go in there. Okay, all right. Um, I guess I could just like cut at one of these. All right. Yeah, I think it was just two that I needed. So let's go back and see what we can do, friends. Let me see if I can get this peeper too, now that I can apparently swim faster, but it really doesn't seem like it. Oh, e oh, oh, there we go. All right, cool beans. Oh, almost missed him. Mm. I don't have either of those things. Wait, what are the things? I don't know if I want to know what the things are. TB TBH. <laughs> All right, so um, we have a knife. I still want to make flashlights. So we need a battery and glass for that. Um, we need two batteries, okay. So, what was the other thing that was needed for the battery? It was it was something new. Ribbon plants. So we're gonna need four ribbon plants. 
All right, we'll have to look around and see if we can get some ribbon plant, guys. It, it looks like it's like this green gemstone or something in like the yellow ribbon as the name implies. All right, yeah, we'll have to be on the lookout for that. Uh, let's go ahead and make this peeper. So yeah, I don't know if there's anything else that I can do right now. Battery, battery, all the batteries. Oh, but we can make the, the tank. We can make the tank. We need the tank. We need the tank. Okay, um, here, and then we'll make this. Almost forgot to do that. I'm like, why did we grab the creep vine? Okay, all right. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I'm noticing, guys, that in here... Deluxe and VIP breathing. That sounds like my kind of experience. Um, okay, so there are also table coral in this game as well. Good to know. But I'm noticing in here that um, you can craft first aid kits. So is there not like a first aid kit fabricator type thing like there is in the original game? It's only fiber mesh to make it. It's, it's really not that spendy. Um, but interesting, interesting. Okay, let's put away some of these materials. Um, and when I say some materials, I probably mean like most, if not all of them. Um, we'll go ahead and eat some of our stuffs and drink some of our stuffs. Okay, all right. So now that we have the tank, um, I think we will... Um, we will go to the uh, the supply cache thing. It's like a little scary going out of our uh, out of our zone, but maybe I should look for the um, the the ribbon plant beforehand. But I don't know how close by it's gonna be, so maybe we can find some on the way to the uh, to the to the cache. Hopefully, hopefully. Hi, Gwen. How are you? I hope you're having a great day. Cozy Grow crashed to my PC. Oh no, but I can play Subnautica, Sims 4, and Pine with uh, with no crashes. Aren't my PCs weird? Like, it just, it makes you wonder what in that game is causing that. It's like something that's just like conflicting with something else. How's, uh, how's audio sounding, guys? Is that, like, I know like right now you can't really hear any music, but like earlier, did it sound too, too loud or anything? I heard some noises. <laughs> Can I cut these? Um, I'm assuming not. Here's another sea glide fragment, but we don't have a scanner yet. There's a lot of fragments around here. Oh, oh, that boy was kind of like swimming towards me. Okay, all right, let's just stay away from him, I think. Oh, I wish I could swim faster. Like, it, even though we have the fins, like, it's just, we're still so slow. It'll be so nice when we can um when we can get the the sea glide. Because there's a bunch of fragments. Just need to get the scanner. Guys, we're on the lookout for some ribbon plants. So if you see any ribbon plants, let me know. Let me know. Ooh, oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, what's going on? I'm frozen! I'm frozen, guys! Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh my gosh, what was that? Was it because like I touched the it sounded like there was a creature near me. What was that? What was that? Was it, was it, I just, was it because I got too cold? Uh, I don't know, I didn't like that though. Especially considering I was running out of oxygen. Another creature egg, okay. I say another creature egg. This is technically the first one that we've come across in this game. There's the, the penguin dudes. Ooh, there's one of those boys. All right, okay, those look a little scary. Where am I even going right now? It's over this way. I'm getting disoriented. Do we need to go underneath the ice or do I need to go over top of it? I don't know if I could get over top of that. Um, this is scary, y'all. This is really scary. There's some salt here. Okay, you're getting stuck, Bean. Okay, it looks like we can get some air right here. Oh, this is frightening. 
here it is right here okay cool just the problem is I don't have a scanner to like scan any of these things I really should have waited to come here well we can take that flare um we can take some water oh a beacon um do I I'll probably keep it here so that we can come back and scan some stuff first aid kit cool um, I'm just like watching out for the dudes around here. Look at that thing over there. Oh, there's just so much to see. <sighs> Haven't seen any ribbon plant yet though. Or if I have, like I just like completely didn't register that it was right in front of me. So we need to look for that. What was that? Was that, what are these guys? They have like, oh, oh, he kind of looks like a bitey boy. I don't know if I should be taking him. <laughs> All right, um, it looks like oh, we can swim further down there. All right, I'm gonna grab some oxygen and then we're gonna go for that supply crate that's down below. Oh, there's a couple down here. All right, all right, no big creatures try to come and get my butts. Oh, that looks really ominous, friends. Was there, um, was there, no, it was just a fish. <sighs> oh, and there's one of those creatures right there. Oh my gosh. Um, oh, there's one right there. Oh, oh, you don't know if they're friendly. But in this game, until you know otherwise, you just kind of assume they're not. <sighs> ribbon plant, where can I find a ribbon plant? Oh. Um, hello, is there any ribbon around here? Why can't I take this copper? I probably don't need all this salt, but here we are. Oh, yeah, okay. Um, titanium. It's like eerily quiet. <gasps> There's a guy right there. Oh, oh, um, oh. okay, let's go up here. Oh. Did you figure out what your fourth dial is for? Um, we have oxygen. Um, oh, okay. Oxygen is the big one. Health, food, water, temperature. So it must have gotten really low somehow. No, these sounds are. Guys, I don't, I don't know about the the ribbon plant stuff. Would it be down there, maybe? Maybe? We might have to go down there, and I, Wait Lady does not like that. Oh. All right. Okay. Let's, um, let's see if we can, we can find any. It had, like, some green stuff in it, the ribbon plants. Ooh, silver! We need the that! Titanium, freaking heck. Oh, guys. Oh. Is that like an oxygen plant there? Or is that something? Replenish oxygen. Okay, that answers that question. Oh, and then it goes back. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have taken that right now. I didn't know that it was going to do that. Oh, guys. Oh, guys. This is positively terrifying. What is, what is, what is, what is, what is that? Oh, crash fish, hello. Oh, I was really hoping that you guys wouldn't be in this game. But they are, they are. Did he go back in his hole? Is that what happened there? He's right there, this bitch. It looks like there's some stuff Oh, it is. It's like a laser cutter fragment. Okay, all right. Um, yes, some right here. Oh, there's a dude right there too. Don't like him. I'm sorry if I get behind on chat, guys. It didn't replenish that much. Oh, there's a bunch of like crash fish around here. Oh no, oh no. Oh no, he's about to hit me. <gasps> Did he not? 
Oh, but here comes another. This one's going to. Luckily, it didn't do too much damage, but still. But still. <sighs> um. I like. Uh, I kind of feel like I'm missing something down here. Like it was maybe supposed to go down into some area, and maybe I missed it. I just. Yeah. Warning. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. <sighs> We're good. We're fine. <sighs> Alright. Okay. So, um... <laughs> where am I right now? We'll go this way. Um, we, we got, like, a bunch of new materials there. That's good. I still didn't get any of the, of the, uh, whatchamacallit? The, the ribbon plants. And I just, I feel like at this point, I've, I've gotta be missing it somewhere. So yeah, we'll have to go back. We'll have to go back or, or something like that. Or maybe go in a different direction. I don't know. Shiva Fing, how's it going? Enjoying it so far? I am. I am. I've been so excited for Below Zero. Um, it's just been, like, really fantastic so far. Just uh, good and, and terrifying. You know, as, as Subnautica typically is. <laughs> Mm, just enjoy the game. Yep, no, enjoy the game. Try to live. All of those things. Don't feel bad for missing some chat. Thanks, guys. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. Okay, so how many materials did we get there? We got a lot of materials. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and drink that one. Um, we'll put some stuffs in here. I know salt in the original game, you could use two, um, I'm glad that egg only took up one spot. Uh, you could use to um, make like better water and like make bleach or something. But I don't know if we have like the recipe for that yet. Waterproof locker, that'll be good to make. Probably gonna have to do that very soon because uh, this guy's getting a little full, a little full to say the least. Let's um, put that flare over there too and the nutrient block. I keep hitting wrong buttons. I guess we could go ahead and save. Haven't done that yet. Even though we're not too far into the game, but still, nonetheless. This so, is it more terrifying or less terrifying than the original game so far? It's really hard to say, Gwen, because like right now I've really only been in like, I don't know if this is called the safe shallows in this game, but the equivalent of the safe shallows. Um, I haven't really gone to any of the other areas yet, so I don't want to speak too soon, but we'll see, we'll see. All right, guys, ribbon plant. Ribbon plant is what we're looking for. It looks like a, like a green gemstone in like some, some yellow ribbon. Hi, Alan, how are you? I wish Subnautica was online sometimes. When Below Zero was, was first being made, um, here we go, right here. How, I wasn't expecting it to be glowy. I think I'm gonna need several of those. Nice, there's a bunch of it in here. Well, there are three, there are three. Seconds of oxygen um, yeah, when Below Zero was first coming out, people were speculating that it might be like multiplayer, but at the same time, like, although I think it would be amazing to be able to play, like, a great game like Subnautica with friends, I feel like it would be a completely different game because, like, you know, Subnautica, it, like, the, the heart and soul of it is, like, you feeling like you are, like, alone by yourself in this, like, big open world. Um, and, you know, that fear of the unknown. And, like, I feel like having like other people with you would like provide like a kind of like a sense of comfort that like Subnautica really does not want you to have. <laughs> so, so I understand, I understand in that regard. So we got three of those ribbon plants. I was kind of thinking that we might need four. Um, so I was kind of looking to see if we could find another. That one we found in a cave. So if I can find like another cave, we can maybe get some more cool beans. 
ask and you shall receive. Um, yeah, we'll take those guys. All right, cool beans. Uh, oh, and there's some more over here. So many things. I definitely need to go ahead and, and make the the, uh, the storage because yeah, we are gonna be completely tapped out here. These things are cool, like the tentacle looking things. A little scary, but kind of cool, kind of cool. Okay. How you liking the new one, Wade? So we're not too far in. Uh, we just started up a little bit ago, um, but so far it's been wonderful. It's so nice to, to get back into the world of Subnautica, but have like a, you know, a, a new story, new stuff to experience and that kind of thing. Today was graduation. When did you graduate today? I can't get to walk because the college is too far away. Officially done with my associate's degree. Guys, can we get lots of hype and chat for our wonderful friend, Miss Cute Little Penguin? That's such a great accomplishment, friend. GG. GG, we're so proud of you. Mm, given and take situation, honestly, 100%. 100%. The Wi-Fi in this laundromat is completely rubbish. I mean, if they had like, you know, um, subpar or like not subpar, but like <laughs> above par, like really fantastic Wi-Fi at the laundry, the laundromats, like I'm sure like everybody would be uh, just, just up in there with their, their streaming setups. Can someone tell me if Wade is still being awesome? Never, never. <laughs> Hey, Brock2, nice to see you. How are you? I hope you're having a good one. All right, so we can make the uh, the batteries now, guys. What should we make first? I did make the tank. I made the fins. I, sh I might be able to make a wiring kit now, maybe? Oh, I oh, wait a minute. Hang on. I thought I got some silver. Did I put it away? I did. I did put it away like a silly billy. Okay, we're going to take that back and we're going to make this. All right. And then what else? What else do we need? Today? Oh, yeah, you can pin recipes in this game, guys. Oh, that's freaking fantastic. So, like, I don't, like, completely forget what I was doing. Repair tool. I'm sure we're going to need that, but we need crystalline sulfur for that, um, which I don't have right now. In the original Subnautica, you couldn't get Crystalline Sulfur until, like, much later game. Um, so I'm assuming with this one, you can get it, like, earlier on. That's interesting. Okay, um, let's make some glass. We'll do that, too. Go back over here, get some of the, the uh, heckin' quartz that we got. <laughs> we got a good bit of that. Let's do that. Okay. Just making all the things. Sorry guys, we're gonna be doing some some crafting simulator for a little bit here. All right, so we'll go ahead and make that. I wanna make I wanna make the scanner, so we'll go ahead and do that as well. Yeah, because that was like a big thing that was really holding us back, not having the scanner. So yeah, now we can. All right, I have a scanner. Oh, feels good. Cool beans, cool beans. Was that the only thing that I wanted to make there for now? Oh, I did want to make the uh, the compass. Okay, so for that, I think I'm going to need two copper. Yeah, two copper. All right, so we'll take you and I'm going to put that away. I'm going to take one of these I'm going to put those guys in there. Okay, because um, yeah, no, I probably want to make a storage here soon. All right, we'll make that. And I definitely need to get some food soon as well, because, yeah, we're about 50% on that. Uh, and we'll make the compass. So we actually have a sense of where we're going. Feels good, man. Okay, all right. I think I have, like, all the things that I wanted to make right now. That's a feels good. That's a very feels good. Um, but, yeah, let's go ahead and make that... that uh, oh. That's not what I meant to do there. Um, let's go ahead and make that storage. I'll do that as well. Um, and we'll put that outside. So yeah, now that we have scanner, guys, um, I'm going to um, go in here and move some of this stuff around a little bit. I want to go back to that area 
from before. Oh, and look, it shows like the battery strength on here too. That's pretty cool. I want to go back to that area that we were at um, previously because there was a bunch of stuff to scan there and obviously I didn't have a scanner at the time. So, um, what we will do is we'll pull out our handy dandy scanner and let's do all the scannings. Scan every, every heckin' creature that I see. Oh, come here, bladderfish. Hold up. <laughs> it's gonna be fun trying to, uh, to scan a peeper. Those are a little finicky. We have the bullseye shrooms. And I think I had a log that I needed to listen to as well. Scanning at last. Here we go. Here goes the battery and titanium. Now comes the scanner. Every xenobiologist's favorite tool. Right? This planet has some fascinating flora and fauna. I might turn up uh, sound logs a little bit. I don't know how it's sounding for you guys. For me, it sounds a little quiet, but I don't want to kill you guys' ear holes too. Let's try 80. I can't wait to learn about them. Hopefully that's this not too will loud. Also give me access to a greater tool set. All right, we got I'm you. Assuming Altera left behind tech that I can scan for blueprints. Boomerang fish. We need to get one of those. And exploring out here a bit easier. Don't worry, Sam. I haven't forgotten. I'm here for you. But it can't hurt to do a little research on the side, right? <laughs> She's like, I'm here. I'm here for I Sam to figure out like how she died or or something like that. But you know, we just we can take in the views and the experiences while we're here. Well, I meant to like. I meant to scan him before. Oh, here we go. Here's another. Cool beans. Works for me as long as we can get to him. Oh, just sit still. Sit still, guy. There we go. Uh, I'll take you. We'll scan these ribbon plants and we'll take some more of those as well, I think. Okay. Because it doesn't seem like there's the most of them. So yeah. <gasps> Wait. Oh, red wart. I was like, there's something here. All right, cool beans. Um, violet bow will get you two. The violet bow is not looking very violet, if I do say so myself. Maybe at night it looks more violet? Maybe that was just a fluke? Can I scan these penguin guys? Are you guys friendly? They haven't like tried to attack me yet, so... Peng Pengwing, penguins. I love them, I love them so much. Can we have one as a pet? Oxygen. Shelf coral. All right, so much to do, so much to see. Wasn't there something that needed some table coral, which is right over here? We'll go ahead and get some of that as well. Oh, I, this looks like table coral to me. Is that not table coral? Twisted mandrake. Weren't mandrakes one of the things in, uh, wasn't it like the crying thing in, in Harry Potter? Am I imagining that? It sounds familiar. Oxygen. Always in need of oxygen. Frickin' heck. Oh, I don't know how we did anything without our, our current tank, but I'm already, already in need of another one. Oh, that'll be lovely to have. Okay, so we'll go back over this way. Um... We need to put out that storage container that we got. We need to look through all of these, uh, this data that we're getting. Jeez Louise. Now we're gonna have quite a bit to catch up on. Okay, so I know that there was a sea glide fragment near our base, so definitely wanna get that. In one of those caves that we went down, there was a bunch of stuff like down there as well, like the laser cutter fragment. I wonder if I could find that again. One of three on sea glides. We're gonna have to find two more of those. I don't think that'll be a problem. Gwen, thank you for the lurk. I appreciate it so much. What's your favorite new thing about the game so far? Um, one of the things that I absolutely love is that you can pin blueprints now, um, which I'm like trying to remind myself that you you can even do. Whereas like before, like you had to like remember everything off the top of your head or just like write it down. Um, that's really nice. There's also like weather in this game, which like there wasn't really weather um, before. It shows you, oh my gosh, is that because I scanned it? It's a chance of copper. So it like, it, it like tells you what you can get out of them. That's really cool too. Cool beans, cool beans. Okay, so what do I want to put in this storage container is the question. Let me see what I have a lot of. 
Maybe we can make this storage container for titanium, perhaps? Um, yeah, that'll clear up some, some space. What else would I want to put in there? Maybe some quartz? I don't know if I'm going to have room for all of these things, but we'll see. We'll see what we can do. I'll put those guys away in there. Uh, we need to cook these peepers. Let's go ahead and do that. Mm. Megnar, welcome in. Er, Meg, Megan, Megan R. If I can read, that'd be great. <laughs> welcome in, how are you? It is from Harry Potter. Okay, okay, cold beans. Not going crazy. Feels great. <laughs> And lovely Susie, how are you? I hope you're having a great day. How's the new game so far? It's been so wonderful. Oh, it's just been so nice to get back into Subnautica. I hope you're having a great day. All right, let's um go ahead and drink some water. I think I had some more water in here, didn't I? Yeah, I, I did. All right, we'll go ahead and take that out too. Um, so let's go ahead and release these, release the Kraken. JK, release the storage, same thing. We'll drop you there. And, uh, I was like, where'd you go? <laughs> Wait, no, I didn't want to draw, didn't want to pick it up. Hang on, redo. Okay. Um, well, eh, open storage. All right. So, um, let's do. Y'all didn't see anything. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. <laughs> open storage. Switch container. <laughs> oh wow okay this is off to a great start already um let's go in here just trying to get the the um hang of controls and all that jazz might have to make another storage container here soon um okay all right so yeah i think what we're gonna do is um i'm going to head back towards the cache since we had some stuff to scan there See if we can go down into one of those caves again too, um, because yeah, there was there was like some stuff down there that we could scan, but I don't know which cave it was. Need to catch up on my my uh, PDA stuff as well. Mm. This sub badge be looking cute. I'm so glad that you like them. Yeah, I know our new sub badges were done by Rosie Poo. She's a wonderful bean um, here on uh, on Twitch and on Twitter. Um, <gasps> See Glide Fragments. Here we go. Um, and because our previous sub badges I had had like since I started streaming, um, and I did them myself, so they were not professional by any means. Um, Oh, whoa, 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 scary dude, scary dude. I was swimming right to him. Um, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> he was right in front of my face. Is he gonna be right behind me when I turn around? Oh, I hope not. Um, did you guys see that? I don't know if they're friendly or not, but like they kind of like had like a friendly look about them. But most things that want to kill you do. Um, so there's that. Have I not scanned this one? Oh, oh, I can make the sea glide now. Okay, all right. How do I make the sea glide? Battery, lube, copper wire, titanium. Before we go anywhere else, I am making the sea glide because I need it so much. Tell a man thanks for the follow. How are you? I hope you're having a great day. Oh, feels good. It feels good, man. But yeah, I know with the uh, new sub badges, I was like, I love tea. I love plants. How can I combine the two? And so we have plants in little tea cups. And I just thought it was heckin' precious. I'm, I'm glad that you guys think so too. Let me just, just go ahead and pin this. Um, all right. So we're gonna need two copper, which I think we already have. One lube. For the lube, we need one creep vine seed cluster. Yeah, hopefully we have enough copper. All right, so yeah, I think it's just the creep vine seed cluster that we really need. 
Hopefully, hopefully. There's one of those dudes over there. Don't really like them. I would like to get a scan on them, but... Uh, they look cute. Like, I, I'm, I kid you not. I kid you not. Anything that wants to invite you in just before it just slays you in the night. They always look cute. They always look cute. So I don't, I don't trust like that. I don't trust like that. All right. Take you. Oh, oh, I, uh, I need to, oh, 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 oh. There we go. I was like, hang on, there's a separate scan here. There we go. All right, cool beans. So now we return to the handy dandy base. Just the, the Aurora Borealis in this game is just so beautiful. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. Oh. <laughs> so far, so good. Glad to hear it. Glad to hear it. I started playing this in Subnautica when they were on a early release. Nice, nice. I um, my first Subnautica playthrough was uh maybe a little over a year ago. Um, but since then I've played through it a couple times, and I just I could not wait for this game to release. It's just it's been so wonderful so already so far. Oh, words are hard. Okay, so. Let's go ahead and make the loop first. Oh, I love the pin blueprints. Look at this. This is, this is glorious. This is glorious. We'll make a battery, which we're going to need a couple ribbon plant for. Thank goodness we got like a few of those. All right. Do, 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 do. We're going to need copper wire for that. We're going to need two copper. Thank goodness we have a good amount of copper. Mmm, they, they, they're the worst, the worst things in, in these waters. I don't know if you're being serious or joking with me, but either way, I'm staying away from them. <laughs> all right, um, and yeah, we have all the things now. Sea Glide. Oh. The Sea Glide is a personal transportation device used for high-speed free diving. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Oh, you are so beautiful, you heckin' sea glide, you. All right, I'm going to put you there. Um, you there. Um, you here. And I've got one more free spot, and that's good enough for now. We can take off. It looks like they changed the um, the the uh, the the, the map thing, Dumahickey, on it. Because, like, I never used it before. Oh, Toggle Map has a completely separate button. I'm glad that they made some changes to it um, for this game. All right, so... Um, before we go back to that cache, let's catch up on, on some of these guys. My friends. Limestone outcrop, titanium and copper source. We, we kind of knew that. So what's the difference with the... I need to find one of those Galana ones again. With the Galana, I know we got titanium, but I would assume it's something else, too. We got the peng, peng, peng wings. The peng wings. <laughs> look at those, those teeth, though. They look cute, but they ain't anything to mess with. Assessment. Less cuddly than they look. Oh, no. Okay, all right. Well, I'm glad that I survived when, uh, when scanning that one earlier, because, like, by the sound of it, it sounds like they could attack. Consumes small prey fish and regurgitates them for its young. Delicious. Retractable tail and claws allow the fast evasion of predators underwater. Maximum grip on the ice. Sharp teeth concealed inside the beak can tear chunks out of aggressors and prey alike. Huddles in packs on the surface. So maybe like it wouldn't attack me unless I attacked it, hopefully. And I don't plan to attack it. Arctic peeper, very edible, bladderfish, that's good for, for water. Uh, membrane has applications as a natural water filter, yes. Boomerang, edible, hoopfish, also edible. What do we have in here? Creep vine, vital alien resource. Oh, it is edible, interesting. Construction applications. Creep vine seeds, vital alien resource, construction applications. 
Bullseye shroom is harvestable and plantable, pink narrow leaf. This grass-like species grows in small clusters near coral bridges. They look really cool. It doesn't look like um, you can you can like take samples of it though. Redwort, common plant adaptable to many different. Yeah, my friends, now. We're having some later. Hi. Wade Lajuicy. Wade Lajuicy, know you. <laughs> Fast, thanks so much for the 11 months. That is like one month away from something, especially Wade Lajuicy. Fast, thanks so much, guys. Can we get some hype in chat? Welcome back to the sub family. I hope that you enjoy your badge, your emotes, your special role in the Discord. How's it going, friend? It's good to see you. So in the red wort one, it doesn't say that we can plant that one either, but I know in um, the original Subnautica, we could plant it in that game because I had that at my at my, my fancy base. I like the look of the ribbon plant. I think that's really cool. Sorry, I'm so behind on chat, guys. Shelf coral. Stony corals have hardened in biocomposites, creating the groovy shelf appearance. Groovy. I like it already. <laughs> Hi, Platt. How are you? I hope you're having a great day. Mm. Hey, not your daddy. Oh, it's good to see you again. Thanks so much for the raid. Welcome, welcome in, guys. Also, Strawberry Head, thanks for the follow. I consider myself uh, a bit of a Strawberry Head as well. <laughs> Welcome in, everybody. If you're new here, my name's Wade. I am a Variety Games caster. Uh, today we're starting up the brand new Subnautica Below Zero. I've been so excited for this game, but I also play some cozy games like uh, Stardew Valley, Story of Seasons, Cozy Grove. We're glad to have you here. We're glad to have you. Daddy-o, how was your stream? What were you playing? And Draco, thank you for doing the shout-out for Not Your Daddy-o. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. Mmm... And yeah, thank you guys for understanding. Yeah, I know. So the, obviously this is my first playthrough of it. So like been like going in like pretty much like completely blind. So yeah, I know. Thank you for, for going along uh, this experience with me. Twisted Mandrake. Yeah, I think that was the, the crying dudes, the crying plants from, uh, from Harry Potter. Violet Bow. All right. Okay. So yeah, I think we're caught up with everything there then. I believe, I believe. For the sake of my OCD, let me close up some of these tabs here. Because <laughs> this is just a little excessive. No problemo, just finished off. Uh, oh, you were playing. Wait, hang on. You just finished off Below Zero. Oh, so Daddy, did you like start it up before they um, released like the ending of it? And so like you just, because I know today they released like the ending. So oh, I'm just, I was about to say, I'm so excited to see like what the ending is, but we just started. So yeah, no, I, I hope we're not too close to the ending right now. That'd be a little awkward. <laughs> oh, and you were doing some Resident Evil 8 too. Nice, nice. How far have you gotten in Resident Evil 8? I hope you've been enjoying it. But yeah, I know it's been so nice to, to be back in the in the land of Subnautica. I guess I can go ahead and unpin another one. Delta Station. So it's interesting to me that there's no there's no radio in this game, guys. Wow, that's pretty far away. We're gonna go back over here first because um, this is where the is there a peeper just like stuck on there? There's a couple peepers stuck on there. Oh no! Oh no! Okay, so we just like kind of like eat our bodies on there. That's interesting. Um. Yeah, we're gonna go back over here, guys, because um, there was like so much ribbon plant. How did I miss all of these? Because there was some stuff that we could scan over here when I first uh, got to this cache, but I didn't have the scanner at the time. So yeah, we're gonna go do the thing. I'm so glad that we have a sea glide now. I probably should make an extra battery because I feel like we're gonna need one of those soon, TM. Oh, we can swim so much faster. Isn't this wonderful? Isn't it glorious? Hey, Death Eagle, nice to see you. How are you? What is this thing? Titan whole fish? Oh, 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 hello. Was that like a biter? Everything is terrifying. Let's get some oxygen. Uh, 
is Shinro. Welcome in. How's it going? Wait, what starts in, in three? Oh, hello, big boy. <laughs> I swam right into him. Oh, I don't know if he's friendly or not, but I didn't like him. I didn't like him one bit. Oh, wow. Okay. Um. <clears throat> anyway. Mineral detector fragment. Ooh, 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 ooh. What are these? New blueprints. What are all the designs. things? Oh. <laughs> I don't like them. I don't like them. They kind of look like clowns. Oh, and he's right there. Okay. All right. Um, sir, if you can just positively heck off for like five seconds, I need to scan some stuff. That'd be great. Oh, sorry for loud noises, y'all. This is just this is just a little terrifying if I do say so myself. I think I can scan um no? Can I not scan those lights? Okay. I think I can take that beacon though. I kinda do want to take the beacon. No, I'll leave it there for now. Um Sea glide fragment. We can get some more tight. Whoa! Hello! They're, why do they keep appearing right underneath my butt? <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Wow. Okay. Um. Yeah, this is bad. This is really bad. Oh, and I think this is technically still considered safe shallows. We're gonna go down here and see what we can find. At least you have these uh these oxygen plants down here. Oh, Ooh, is somebody having some 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 juicy noodles? I hope you enjoy the juicy noodles. Please send juicy noodles here. Sea sea monkey nest? Is that what the the scary dude that was coming for me? Mobile vehicle bay fragments. So do they make their nest? Seconds of oxygen remaining. It's like they make their nest out of um stuff that I need. Oxygen plants. That's interesting. So is he gonna come back here then? I know the other one that we were at, um, it had had something else um, that we can scan, but I don't know where that one was. Kelp root, okay. Oh, there was one of those guys over there. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen. Oh, remaining. is there oh goodness, oh goodness. Um, I would really like to scan all of these things, but... It goes deeper, guys. Oh, there's a guy. There's a guy. Don't like the guy. What is that? It's like a, like a roly-poly dude. There's so many crash fish. <laughs> Go away, guys. He's a, a spinner fish. I, I guess he, he's staying true to his name. Bless his heart. Love him. Love him. See? Yep, he's coming. Go away. Is there another? Yes, there is. Alright. Alright. Okay. Where is an oxygen plant? I might just have to go to surface. I'll just go to surface and we'll go back down. <sighs> All right. Okay. Ooh, deep breaths, deep breaths. I think, yeah, yeah, that's what I think it was too, Rochelle. So we'll see if we can find that one again. It, I feel like it might be connected to this one. Assuming there's like not like a bunch of these caves. This is a radiant sieve coral. That's kind of pretty. It's kind of pretty. Okay. All right. Oh, there's one of those dudes. Don't like them. Don't like them one bit. Um, this is a dead end. All right. Can I go down there? Or maybe there's Warning. just... Passing 100 meters. 
oxygen efficiency decreased. Oh, okay. Um. All right. Oh, there's a lot of these guys. Okay. All right. Um. Taking that. Stay away, my dudes. Stay away. Oh, stay away, sir. Stay away. I just want to scan things. Unknown? Sounds like a distress call. Transmission of unknown origin. Source of transmission depth calculated at approximately 200 meters. I don't even know where I am, guys. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen. Oh, this is another one of those, um, those nests. Okay. We need to come back down here, guys. We do. We do. All right. I think that one was the one that might have had the laser cutter. Oh. Oxygen. Hey, Erica. Erica, why are we just seeing you in here, you silly Billy? <laughs> Thank you for the raid. Uh, Erica, did you have a did you have a stream stream? If so, what were you playing? Were you playing some below zero, perhaps? I feel like we just had you in here. Warning. Welcome back. Thirty seconds of oxygen. Oh, I thought I got enough oxygen there, but apparently not. Okay. Um. Let me just grab the things that I need and oh no. We'll we'll come back. We'll come back. Oxygen. Okay, I'm going. Oh, this is fine. We'll be fine. Everything's fine. Um I was doing some Minecraft. Nice, nice Erica. What uh what were you up to in uh in the Minecraft? Were you doing some building? Alright, um do 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 boop ba doop ba do Warning passing one hundred meters. Maybe that's why it was going down so quickly. <gasps> Here we go. Okay. Mobile vehicle uh mobile vehicle bay fragment. Alright, we'll take that. Two out of three. Maybe this wasn't the one that we saw earlier then that we thought had like a laser cutter on it. There must be another one. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen All right. remaining. Jeez. Jeez. Oh. Okay. I kind of want to go back down there um, and see if we can find like another one of those because we've got like two out of three on it. Oxygen. But we do have like that whole other like place to go to that's like uh, right there. The emer- wait, no. Is it that one? No, it's not that one. Uh, this one, the Delta Station Dock. We need to go there. Before we do, though, I'm definitely going to, um, definitely going to go back to our base first, uh, so that we can drop off some things, probably make another storage container, probably another battery, um, need to drink some water. Um, when I meant to, uh, to cook these peepers, but maybe I picked them up on the way, so we probably couldn't even do that if we wanted to. Okay, so, to this area. <sighs> mm. Mining, exploring, you know, and trying not to die, and that's completely understandable in Minecraft. Completely understandable. Thank you so much for the raid, though. I appreciate it. Also, Sonia, thank you for the hydration. I've been drinking away my smoothie over here, but have not been uh, drinking any water. Let me uh, get inside so we can get some oxygen and then I'll uh, get some hydration for myself. Thank you. I should probably also take some bladder fish if I can grab them so that we can get some water for our character as well. Oxygen. Oh, oh, there we go. There we go. All right, then we go inside. All righty. Ooh, distress call. Okay, we'll have to listen to that too. Uh, didn't die though? That's good. That's good. That's all you can ask for sometimes. <laughs> all right, so um, let's go ahead and listen to the distress call then, and we'll we'll make the Picked things that we need to. Picked up like a distress call. Who or what is out here calling for help? It didn't sound human. Maybe it's from a remnant. Of it's not Sam, right? That'd be a plot twist. In her message, Sam's colleague did say there was something important. Here. Even if it's just a Did they find her body? The intelligent aquatic specimens, that could be a major find. Cured food. Or if it's from Altera, it could have bearing on what happened to Sam. We should definitely check it out. It seems like we've been getting a lot of the salt deposits, so maybe I'll I'll just go ahead and, and make those. Yeah, let's do that. 
And Howard, thank you for the reminder to save two. I will do that in two shakes of a lamb's tail, which is right now. <laughs> thank you. Appreciate you, friend. All right, so um, what else do we need to do? We need to eat some food. Um, Let's go ahead and drink some water. Maybe one more water. We're probably going to have to get some more bladder fish. Yeah. Okay, um, let's go ahead and make another storage locker doomahickey thing. That's right here. We're close to being able to make the mobile vehicle bay. That'll be juicy. I feel like we're getting that uh, much earlier game than we did with the original Subnautica. That's pretty snazzy. All right, so um, we'll drop that there. And I kind of want that lower to be with the other one. Push that down a little bit, yeah, slightly. Um, I would also like to, we'll name this, uh, we'll name it Titanium. <laughs> um, and this one will be, um, we'll do the, the quartz in this one. So let me take out this Titanium. Don't need, oh, guys, I keep making that mistake. I keep throwing out the, the quartz that I mean to put in the storage container. I don't think you could do that in the original, um, where like you can like throw it out or like put it in the storage container if you're looking in there. I don't think that was an option. But yeah, we have like more quartz than we can even carry. All right, so in here we'll put our handy dandy titanium. Okay, I thought we had more than that, but alas, there we are. We'll take it. We'll take it. Okay, so oh, we did have titanium in here. We'll take this, then we'll put these things away in there. All right, silver. Oh wait, what did I just put away? I think I just put away something that I didn't mean to. Maybe. Titanium, that's what it was. Um, we'll put that silver away. Okay, cool beans. Um, and we'll go put this titanium. Um, was it this one? There we go. Uh, we'll put you guys in there, cool beans. And before we go on any more adventures, um, I would really like to um, get some some more bladder fish to make some water. And we have some right here, cool beans. That works out. That works out lovely. Doop. And I'm always like swimming like too fast to get them with my uh, with my sea glide now. Whoa! Go away, scary boy. Go away. Go away. Um, where is my base? Right here. I'm not like crazy about the idea of us going out while it's getting dark too, guys. So maybe we'll listen to some more audio logs. That might be a good idea. Might be something we can do. How do you guys feel about that? <sighs> All right. Close out of that. We'll drink, um, we'll not drink, uh, mm, mm. Yeah, we'll go ahead and drink. Okay. Um, and then we will open up, not that. <laughs> we'll go over here and um, we'll see what else we found. Mineral deposit that often contains silver and titanium. Okay. So, so far the outcrops that I've come across, one I haven't scanned, it was called the Galena one. I know from that one we could get titanium too. And this one, it seems like you can get titanium from like literally every outcrop. So far, not feeling too crazy about that. But this one has silver. This one has copper. Sea monkey nest. So I haven't... Okay, so... Okay, they are those swimmy guys. Sea monkeys. I wonder if it'll tell me if they're friendly or not. Sea monkey nests are large bowl-like structures made of packed sediment and plant matter. Well, we found, like, um, like craft or, like, building materials in there, too. The sea monkeys use their wide, flat tails to pack the materials and form the structure of the nest. Sea monkeys are naturally curious creatures, often drawn to metallic materials. So are they like the stalkers then? Which they gather to reinforce the sides of their nest. Oh. Okay. So don't have anything shiny out when you're around them, is what it sounds like to me. Titan hole fish. <laughs> he looks really cool. I like him. <laughs> cool.
Gwen, I'm so glad that the interview went well. Uh, I have to wait for them to do a background check? Understandable, understandable. Uh, I should, uh, should know in two days. Gwen, I'm just so happy for you, friend. I, I hope that everything goes well. A large docile herbivore which emits oxygen assessment, valuable oxygen source, if you can reach it. So does the oxygen like bubble up from it? The the poor the poor description on the Titan whole fish, slow, stupid, and delicious. Oh no. Wait a minute, can you like grab them and eat them? These kind of seem like too big to grab. Bless his heart. Who wrote this? Who did this? Daza, you shut your mouth. <laughs> Not just like you. <laughs> oh man. Um <laughs> Complex skills uh, attract symbiotes, which make the whole fish their home. Fiercely ward off any approaching life form. Interesting, interesting. Okay. All right, what else do we have? The spinnerfish. The spinnerfish are edible, capable of very high speeds in a straight line, slow wide turning circle, like other small prey if they feed on a variety of seeds. Okay, all right. We have kelp roots. Uh, harvestable for resources, used in fabrication. <gasps> oh, okay. I probably need to go back there then. I didn't I didn't know that I could harvest it. Underwater source of breathable oxygen, useful in free diving scenarios. Yeah, yeah. Or even if you've got like breathing stuff, it's still helpful. This light emitting plant is rem uh, reminiscent of a sieve or a uh, colander. Equipment mineral detector. So yeah, this was not a thing in, in original Subnautica. Using a complex blend of electromagnetic field, transmission, beta decay detection, the mineral detector is capable of identifying nearby sources and approximating distance. So is this like the equivalent of this, of the, like the scanner room in original Subnautica? Two antenna emit an advanced pattern of waves to detect specific materials for mining. An ultra bright display visually communicates distance to the target resource. Proximity alarms add an extra layer of information for finite spatial positioning. Those sounded like a lot of big words, um, but it sounds helpful. It, it sounds pretty helpful, perhaps, perhaps. Yes. Oh, and we can make it. Let's go ahead and make it then. Okay, all right. Um, copper, where you at? Do I have enough? I think I might. I think I might. Um, maybe it's just three. I think I'm gonna need like another cluster of, of some kind. We'll need to go get one of our titanium. We do have a silicone rubber in here. Oh, we don't need a, we don't need a cluster. It's ribbon plants. Okay, we have some of that too. That works for me. All right, cool beans. So let's make a, I was gonna make a couple batteries because our sea glide is getting pretty low. Let's go ahead and do that, guys. Is it just one? I think it's just one. I think, me thinks. All right, so let's make a couple of those. Mmm. All right, and then I probably need to grab another, yeah, I was about to say another titanium. I didn't come out here and grab one in the first place, so we need one. I kind of wish that you could like open them from the bottom. Like I get why that like kind of doesn't make sense, but it would definitely be more convenient if that was the case. All right, so we'll go here and mineral detector, prox proximity detector used to locate materials, fragments, and other items with identifiable signatures. So maybe when it says the identifiable signatures, maybe it's just stuff that I've scanned before, maybe? Maybe it can't pick up anything that I've, I've never scanned before? Well, that's nice. That's really nice. Thank you. Thank you. Much appreciated. All right, so we'll unpin that. And I guess we'll go ahead to the Delta Station, Delta Station Dock. That's a mouthful. Do I have water? I do have a water. Okay. All right. 
let's let's go ahead and do the thing, guys. Oh, I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. And by a little, I mean a lot. <laughs> oh, we're going 500 meters away. That seems really far. There's some more of these, um, these, like, um, tentacle boys here. I don't know what the names of those are. I wonder how deep this goes. I'm nervous, y'all. I'm nervous. <gasps> Ooh! Those things looked like they had a, a, a big bite to them. I'm assuming that they are not friendly. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen. I'm assuming. I'm assuming. Jeffrey, thank you for the reminder to save. How's your day been? Let's go ahead and do that. Do I see a Wade? Wade, where? Sirius, how are you? I hope you're having a good one. Sirius, uh, have you started up below zero yet? You, uh, I'm assuming you're gonna be playing. I hope so, I hope so. It looks like there's some stuff that we can scan down here, guys. This is getting into scarier territory. A sea truck? Is that like a new type of material? Look at these like things here. These like geyser boys. These are kind of scary. Oh, we're gonna have a lot of stuff to scan, my friends. Serenity, thank you for doing this shout out for Sirius. Sirius is a, a wonderful streamer bean. Um, he is a fellow lover. A fellow lover of, of, of the Subnauticus? <gasps> oh my gosh! Ooh, 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 ooh. I hear big baddies Oxygen. on all sides. And I saw a big baddie. And he didn't look friendly. Oh, did you see him? He looked really fast. I came back to stream at the wrong time. No, you came back at the right time. I need all the hand holding that I can get. How's it going? How's it going? Hope you're doing well. Abandoned PDA. This is like the first one of these that we found. The picture of the dude on there, he's the one um, that was in the, the cinematic trailer four below zero. All right. Let's uh let's go ahead and see about that, my friends. Ooh, our our temperature is going down. Might have to jump into the water cuz I think they said that would that would fix it, I think. I think. Fred, I'm not blaming you. Tomorrow it's going to be but good. What do you mean? Emmanuel. Gone? Emmanuel's got some good hair. Go. You see that facial hair too? We found some trouble nice. in bridges and decided to jettison modules. Yeah. I had a jettison a module. I got this is Fred. Fred backwards. was the one in the cinematic. Gone. And you think someone stole it? Or something. I didn't lose it, that's for sure. I'm careful with my tools. I'm sure you are, but you have to admit, there have been a lot of sea truck accidents, and they're rather expensive. You want to follow me on a few runs tomorrow? See what it's like? Conditions are way harsher than anything I ever imagined. You're just getting some more, uh, some more really heat. Understand it from inside your base. Oh, I'm making that won't be necessary. Too. Thanks for your time. I'll write it up as an accident. Somehow I feel like it wasn't an accident. Trash can. That'll be helpful. <gasps> a bench. I love the benches. We can make just like a nice little sitting area in a in, in an upcoming base. That'll be precious. Very precious indeed. Bloodlight. All right. Um, what is this thing? It doesn't seem like it's something that I can scan. So okay, a coughing vending machine. Something that every good base needs. They're a little chunky though. Kind of creeps me out how they talk. We'll take the desk. That'll be good. Um, cylinder flask. We'll take you. I kind of like the look of that one. I wish that that one was ours. That kind of looks like a like a like a single pod like coffee pot there. I don't know what that is. I don't think we can take the uh I don't think we can take those notes that are underneath there. It doesn't seem like it'll let me. All right, let's uh go replenish some some heat here. Also Reaper, thanks for the host. How are you, friend? It's good to see you. 
Mm, he just wants a cuddle? I'm good, I'm good. I'm not feeling the cuddles right now. I heard a loud noise from my headphones all the way in the kitchen. I, I, it was either the creature or me screaming. One of the two. Um, but yeah, no, there is like a creature. This is a recorded message. If you can hear this, you're trespassing. If you know it's good for you, you'll get the hell out of here. That sounds... Did they pick up snow? <laughs> Why? Why am I picking up snow? Um... That sounded like the same voice actress for Margaret Maida. Thermal Lily, cool beans. Whoa, what is that? Hello? Who was talking? Who was, who was saying that I was trespassing? Oh, here's the crystalline sulfur. Yeah, you do get this a lot faster in this game. Okay. I don't even know where to begin, you guys. This is like, it's so much to take in. Oh, oh. Um. Could we do a snowball fight? Is that what's going on here? S snow, s we, it is a snowball. Hang on, I, I need to test this out. We're about to, we're about to heck somebody up. Can you, like, use it? Is this, like, a weapon? What? <laughs> How does this work? Oh, you just right-click. Okay, all right. That's that's interesting. That's very interesting. Okay. Well, I lost my snowball, but I guess we can get some... There's plenty of snow around here, so that's good. That's good. Okay, all right. Um, Yeah. This looks like we're going to have a lot of stuff to explore, guys. 